Hey everyone, this is Tiffany. I am a product manager on Confluence Cloud. And today I want to show you how to document like a pro with Jira and Confluence. So by the end of this video, you'll understand how to seamlessly move between a Jira project and a Confluence page to document your project as you and your team work through it. So first we're gonna start on a Jira issue we're working on and need to start writing documentation for. So I'm right here and the team has just finished um, updating the website with new offerings. So I'm gonna copy this issue link just for reference. And now what we can do is go over to the project pages section right here and spin up a blank page. Awesome. So this is something that I typically like to do is that I want to name the page using the same name as the Jira ticket um, or just at least the code part um, because this keeps it really clean and streamlined in terms of the reference between the two products. So I'm going to type in the name of the ticket. Uh, and I pasted the link here just so that's really easy to see. But as you can see, the progress updates automatically and the link looks so beautiful in the editor. So I've pre-written actually the typical structure of documentation that I like to use um, just for the sake of time. And I'm just going to copy paste that in here. So let me get that. Awesome. So I have the driver or the person basically who did the ticket, some documentation here, um, and I have the link. What I like to do is also move the issue link into the box so that it's really clean and easy to reference. Awesome. So now we can publish the page. And for good practice, I actually have a documentation parent page that I like to put this under so that it's really easy to find, just like all the other documentation. Awesome. So now at the top, you might notice that you can easily see Jira links on this page by clicking this up here. This will show all the Jira issue links that are dropped into this page all in one place. Cool, so thanks for joining. This is how you can document like a pro and seamlessly switch between Jira and Confluence without losing sight of your tasks. Thanks for watching.